The following contest is scheduled for one fall. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 493 pounds, the Gate Crashers. Listen to this crowd, guys. They're fired up for this one. As well as they should be, this match has instant classic written all over it. It's time to fly. And their opponents first from Cardiff, Wales. Weighing in at 147 pounds, Mark Andrews. Hard not to get excited when you're about to see a match for Mark Andrews. I swear, this guy lives in a bubble of low gravity. I think the officials need to check his boots for jet thrusters. There is certainly much more to him than meets the eye. Guys, this match will undoubtedly go a long way in determining just who is the most dominant superstar. That's what makes this match so great. These superstars clearly have a point to prove here tonight and will likely do anything necessary to go ahead and prove that point. A true pioneer! And his partner from Honolulu, Hawaii, weighing in at 235 pounds. Ricky the Dragon Steamboat. The Dragon's a man who won the Intercontinental Championship in a classic match with Macho Man Randy Savage. He won the NWA title in a classic match with Ric Flair. Steamboat is a man who can perform and win in high pressure situations. Steamboat getting ready to breathe fire on the opposition tonight. The superstars are ready, and so are we. Here we go. And guys, it seems like these Liverpool crowds get more and more enthusiastic each time we visit. Well scouted reversal there. Ooh. Spinning kick to the gut. Whoa, it's another reversal. And now that one's countered. Great evasion. Ooh, Ooh what impact. Oh, nasty impact. He's certainly looking in command at the moment. Great effort, but he better save something for later in the match. Boom, oh, what impact! Boom! 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 what impact! Boom! Oh, he's taking some good hits. Well, it's not dire consequences for him here, which is good. But just in case, he might want to think about getting his partner in there for a bit. Ooh, well measured. Been kicked right to the gut. When you talk about great tag teams, we can go all the way back to teams like the Tolos brothers, Stevens and Patterson, Stevens and Bockwinkle, the Texas Outlaws, the Briscoes, the Blackjacks, the Andersons, and the list goes on and on. When you're part of a tag team, the two partners have to travel together, train together, eat together, and be completely in sync with one another. Back in from the floor. Tag team competition dates back all the way to the early 1900s. Corey, you mentioned some of the classic duos from sports entertainment's incredible history. In today's WWE, the tag team scene has never been more competitive. I don't know who has the edge when it comes to talent, if it's Raw or SmackDown Live. I think it's too close to call, but all the teams truly think and act as one unit.
I agree, Michael. Teams such as the Usos, American Alpha, Anderson and Gallows, the New Day, the Hardy Boys, Cesaro and Sheamus, I could be here all day naming championship caliber teams. And when the tag team scene is that competitive, you don't know which team will be wearing the gold. Struggling to get to the corner here. Might not make it, Michael. Almost there. So close, so close. Keep going, come on. Oh, and he makes the tag. That was a game changer right there, Michael. to the midsection. These competitors have been going deep into their arsenal all match, but have not found a way to end it at all. Swings in momentum. Every push has been cut off. There are no words for the ride these fans have gone through in this match. It has been a roller coaster, and I don't think the ups and downs are over yet. starting to pile up. The beauty of tag team competition is that he doesn't need to take the entire brunt of the opposition's attack. Though the thought of making a tag doesn't necessarily appear to be. I think the crowd knows what we're about to see. Pile driver. He is in He's hoping at it quickly. Here's another look at some of the previous action, giving their fans their money's worth and more. He's getting it done here. He was on point the entire match, as you can see here. Here are your winners, Mark Andrews and Ricky the Dragon Steamboat. Put it in the books. And there was no question about that one. Hey, this isn't just about going out there and making sure everybody's entertained. You've got to win your matches. And that's exactly what happened here. A will to win was on display. I wouldn't be surprised if we saw these teams going back to it at some point in the very near future.